In today's video, I'll be showing you simple methods to make your Valorant much more colorful and vibrant. Basically taking your game from looking like this to this by using simple steps so you don't want to miss out. Now these settings will be working for Nvidia users and Intel users and any laptop users. So what you want to do for the first step is you want to head over and open your Nvidia control panel. Then you want to head over to the adjust color settings. So for the brightness, you want to put down 50%. Your contrast, what you want to do with that, you want to put down 62%. And your digital vibrance, you want to put that on 75%. You want to make your way all the way to adjust color settings. So click on that. Now you can pause the video and copy all these settings. Now if you're Intel user, you want to follow these methods. So you want to go ahead and open your Intel graphics control panel. Then you want to head over to the display tab. Click on that. And you want to select your display to bolt-in display. Put that on bolt-in display. Put your refresh rate on 60Hz, whatever you're playing on. Then you want to head over to the color settings. And you want to select the color. You want to put that on all color. Then you want to put your saturation. You want to put that on too. Then once you're done with it, you want to save that. Now for any other users that just don't want to use those two methods, you can go ahead and download Razer Cortex. Once you download Razer Cortex, what you want to do is you want to open up the application then what you want to do is you want to hit over to booster prime click on that and you want to click on your validant so once you find that click on your validant then you will find a bunch of settings and you want to click on make adjustments now in the right hand corner there will be make adjustments you want to turn on that once you turn on that you want to put your digital vibrance you want to put that on 51 once you're done with that you want to hit over and save it then once you're done with that the settings should apply but anyway if you found this video helpful please give it a like or subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this also you can watch this video to push FPS in Valorant or if you want to lower your latency in Valorant you can watch the next video